hello guys welcome to solve it and we are back again with another video in this video we'll be proving how 1 plus 1 equals to 0 and not 2 so this is a universal law that 1 plus 1 equals to 2 and not 0 so let's get started how can we prove this as true so let us take a first step would be writing it as same 1 plus 1 equals to 2 so for our first step I would like to subtract minus 1 that is from LHS left hand side and RHS from both the sides so let's mi subtract minus 1 from both the sides uh, next step would be 1 plus 1 minus 1 so we won't be violating any rules so let's I would like to take a square root here of our same thing 2 minus 1 and I'll square it again if you see square and square root gets cancelled and we get the same output as our previous step so it becomes it means literally, literally means 2 minus 1 nothing else so we haven't violated anything till now so in the next step we would be 1 plus 1 minus 1 equals 2 so if you could see here 2 minus 1 square it represents a property x minus y square isn't it so let if we expand it so we would be getting x square minus 2 into x into y plus y square this is a universal property where if you expand it we get this one we have learned it in higher school so let's ap apply it here so after applying we would be getting our x is 2 and y is 1 so 2 square minus into 2 into x that is 2 into y that is 1 plus y square so all good till now we have just expanded the same so let's write it 1 plus 1 minus 1 we are operating most of it on the RHS side that is the right hand side so if you take it 2 square that is 4 that is 2 into 2 4 into 1 that is 4 plus 1 1 square is nothing but 1 so we have got it next we'll be proceeding 1 plus 1 minus 1 equals 2 as 4 minus 4 is 0 we get nothing but 1 so now we'll be implementing a for improved step next time so 1 plus 1 minus 1 here here is where trick is applied so I can take it as square root of minus 1 square so as we all know minus 1 square equals to 1 so I have just taken the, another format of 1 so if you uh, square it you will get the same thing so not, no no problem no nothing I violated so minus 1 square is 1 so though we get again and square root is still there so we get the same step as of back so moving on so I would like to do one thing here so we, I, we have implemented the same so I would like to wave out this part as square root and square cancels each other we have left with minus 1 because square root and square have been cancelling each other so we're getting minus 1 here so and if we take it 1 plus 1 if we take minus 1 on this side it would be plus 1 so that would be 0 so 1 plus 1 and boom we get our answer here 1 plus 1 equals to 0 so we, we are proceeding as it is we started with 1 plus 1 equals to 2 and then we subtracted minus 1 on the, on either side 